for those of you who've never been to Cardiff, this is our lovely St. David's Centre, all decked out for Christmas. And can we just take a moment to appreciate the peace and quiet? It was so quiet. It was about 8.30 on a Thursday <coughs> excuse me, morning. And I was the first person on a couple of the floors in Premark, which is a little bit sad, my daughter told me. But also lovely because it gave me the chance to have a proper look around and, well, decide what I wanted to get before the mad, crazy rush that did obviously happen a little bit later on. So my timing was perfect. I think all the parents must have been dropping off children at school, doing the school run, and it's definitely gonna be the time that I choose if I'm gonna go in there again before Christmas, which I'm sure I will. So next up is the little haul of what I bought while I was there. Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time here, my name is Beck. Thank you so much for joining me. Obviously, usually I will be doing my what I eat in a days or some grocery hauls, but today I have managed to get into Cardiff to go to Primark or Primark, however you want to say it, for the first time since March. Well, probably actually before that for me, it was probably more like January or February. So this is my first haul from there since the actual proper lockdown. Christmas presents. Now, I usually will get my nieces and nephews and obviously little stocking fillers for my children, but I always get them pyjamas. However, for the older ones this year, I have decided to change things a little bit and do a little mini hamper for them because they're getting older. But for all the younger ones, I'm still going to get some pyjamas. So there's lots of pyjamas in here, but also a few other bits and bobs as well. Now, I'm relying on the children of mine that watch me which are two of the girls, not to tell my son that he's got some socks for his stocking. Now, one of the girls that does watch these, watch these, watch me, has told me that she wanted, instead of pyjama bottoms, she wanted tracksuit bottoms. So I picked up the ones that I thought she wanted. Turns out it's the ones that she's already got, so she knows about these anyway. So these are just tracksuit bottoms, and they're only a fiver, and they're really cosy, really comfy, fleece-lined, and lovely. I'm not going to show you those because she does watch and does know I've got this. Some pyjamas. Now these are ladies, insert coffee to begin, and they've got little cuffed bottoms and then a long sleeve top. And they were, what were they? They were £10. Oh, see, I'm, I'm going to have to not show you all the things for them. Picked up a pair of these jeans because they're so handy for Jeff, who doesn't watch me. Oops. <laughs> I don't think. So these are just the skinny jeans for men. Nice colour blue. And they are, I'm whispering because he's there, inside, inside in the living room. And they're just ten pound. So they're a bargain. Oh, she doesn't watch me. <laughs> I hope. Just a crew neck, khaki sweatshirt, six pound. I think it's a men's one. I hope you can hear me. Some t-shirt bras. And that was eight pound for three of them, which is absolute bargain. Okay, so I've got for one of my nephews, some Jurassic Park pajamas. And they're five to six, and I think they were either six or seven pound. They were seven pound, and they're all lovely and fleecy. My Christmas wrapping paper. I like to wrap because we've got four children. I like to wrap each of them in different paper so we know whose is whose. So this year we've got a gingerbread one, a snowflake one, a fair isle one, and an elf one. I actually bought these for myself because. I've never really been one for fluffy socks, but when I've been coming home and getting changed from work, I've been putting pyjamas on and then just socks. And I put fluffy socks on the other day and they were lovely. So I treated myself to these, is two pairs of thermal ones. And they're really stretchy. They're really, really thick. And they were only 350 for the two pairs. So I don't if the black ones are just plain. Yeah, just plain black with a bit of gray on them. 350, you can't go wrong. Stop getting pillows. More stocking fillers. Okay, for one of my nephews, I have got marble pajamas. They're just plain. Can you see them there? So they're just plain red, plain top rather. So just red and blue with marble on them. 
and then marble on the bottoms and I think they were seven pound yep seven pound for those nice and fleecy as well and then for my other nephew I have got a pair of the same so the Jurassic Park there's no fighting and arguing then even though they don't live in the same house they probably wouldn't fight and argue anyway these are Jurassic Park fleecy pajamas in a four to five I think I managed I might have we needed to get a five to six in those so they may need to be changed but that is my little shopping haul from Primark today and I think let's have a look at the receipts about 90 pounds I think I need my glasses 93.95 which when you take out what I bought that's not too bad at all thank you so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and I look forward to seeing you in the next one